Friday, July 19, 2019. Welcome to Weekly Wire. Here's a look at some local South Washington County news. Several kids spent a couple days this week at Carver Lake Park in Woodbury for the annual safety camp. Recreation and Public Safety hosted the event that taught kids how to be safe at home, in the water, and more. Highlights for the campers included canoeing, archery, and a spirited game of tug of war. Safety camp happens every July for kids ages 8 through 11. If you know someone or you yourself have a green thumb in Cottage Grove, then you could win the 2019 Green Garden Award. Nominations are now being accepted until July 28th. Commercial and residential properties are eligible. Awards will be given based on overall appearance, plant variety, creativity, and environmental aesthetics. Download a nomination form on the City of Cottage Grove's website or pick one up at City Hall. The District 833 Schooly bus is still making the rounds this summer. Between 5 and 6.30, the bus stops at different elementary schools, bringing with it activities, games, and food. On Mondays, the bus is at Royal Oaks, Tuesdays, Newport Elementary, Wednesdays, Pullman, and on Thursdays, Armstrong. Activities are free and all are welcome. Volunteers are needed to be members on the St. Paul Park Parks and Recreation, Public Safety, and Public Works Commissions. The city is also looking for volunteer police reserves. Details can be found on the city's website. Third Lair will be hosting a skateboard competition at Hamlet Park on July 26th. This is a free event for all levels of skateboarders and a fun night for the community, complete with a DJ, music, and prizes. Registration will be on site at 5 p.m. and the event starts at 6. The City of St. Paul Park will be celebrating National Night Out on Tuesday, August 6th. There will be police cars and fire trucks to explore, games, food, and more at Heritage Park from 6 until 8 p.m. Residents in Cottage Grove wanting to run for City Council can soon apply. There will be one open seat with the term finishing at the end of 2020. Filing opens on July 30th and you will have until August 13th to file at City Hall. Thanks for tuning in. We'll be back next week with more local news. Be sure to subscribe to our Weekly Wire podcast and find us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and YouTube. Thank <laughs> you.